Hi, in this video, I am going to show you how to install Lexmark X1240 printer on your Windows computer. I am going to install this on my Windows 11 computer, but it will work on Windows 10, Windows 8 and Windows 7 as well. First of all, I am going to show you how to install it using its installer and if it is, doesn't work on your computer then I will also show you how to install this printer using its basic driver. Both of the driver download links are given in the video description so please check out the video description for the download links. So let's get started. As I told you, this is the full feature driver with the installer and this is the basic driver. So if we will start with the full feature driver, you can download both of the download both of the drivers from the video description. There's two different situations. So please follow the instructions carefully when we install the full feature driver when you start it your printer should not be connected to the print uh, computer through the usb cable please disconnect the usb cable after disconnecting double click on the installer file it will be extracted Click on install. Please don't, don't be confused uh, with the Lexmark 1200 series installer. It will work with your X1240 printer as well. Click on install. Click on continue. Click on agree. And click on continue again. Please wait. Now select the option with the USB cable. Now connect the printer's USB cable to the computer. When you connect it, it will be automatically this the, the this button continue button will be automatically be activated and then you can click on continue i'm going to cancel it now so because i don't have the printer so i'm canceling it from here when you click click on continue after connecting your printer it will be automatically detected and installed automatically. Now we come to the uh, basic driver. Let's see if it if the full feature driver is not working for you, then how to install the basic driver. So in this in in the basic driver installation process, you need to connect the USB cable printer's USB cable to the computer and make sure the printer is turned on properly. So after turning on your printer and connecting your printer, just double click on that file, the basic file and click on extract all. Click on extract. A folder will be created here on the desktop or on the same folder where your driver file is located. Double click on the file folder and click double click on the printer drivers. Double click on the 
64 bit because we are we have on the 64 bit computer you need to install with the with this file lxczprc.inf let's see how to install printer using this file because this is not a executable file so we cannot install it from here directly there is a different process i am going to show you just minimize it for a while and click on the start button click on settings click on bluetooth and devices click on oh sorry click on printer and scanners here your all the printer and scanners are listed here so click on add device click on manually click on add manually now click on add a local printer and click on next here you need to select the printer's usb port printer port where your printer is connected right now select the port usb 001 and usb 002 and click on next click on have disk button now you need to select the, that file that we have i have shown you there on the extracted folder click on browse and go to the folder Lexmark 1, here it is, printer driver, 64 bit, and this one. Click on this file and click on open. Click on OK. Here you go. Select the Lexmark 1200 series and click on next. Here you can change the printer name. Please don't don't get confused with the Lexmark X1240 or Lexmark 1200 series driver because both are the same printer and same uh, the the x1240 will use the 1200 series driver so it is trying to install so please wait while it will be done After that, click on next and click on finish. The printer is installed. So that's it for you. Hopefully you have learned how to install this Lexmark printer using the full feature driver and the basic driver if you like this video please like share and subscribe our youtube channel have a good day bye bye